What's up ShareMix and welcome back to another video. Today's video I'm so excited for and I don't know why I haven't filmed it a really really long time ago because if you know me or if you've been subscribed to my channel for a while you know that I am obsessed with buying cases for my phone. I haven't ordered any cases recently but I think I'm gonna be doing a big bulk order on AliExpress very soon for new cases for my phone so I can do an unboxing and a review for you guys because you guys seem to like the first one of those I made. So in this video I'm gonna be showing you guys all the iPhone cases that I own I'm even gonna show you the ones from my iPhone 5 which I no longer have but I still have the cases for it I did sell a couple of the cases so this isn't all the cases that I've ever owned and I am missing a couple cases which is kind of sad because some of my most important cases have gone missing like my one with a pop socket I don't know where it went it was my most expensive case I had like a perfect clear case because I have the red iPhone 7 plus but I literally lost my clear case so now I am forced to cover my phone with a non-clear case and sometimes it sucks because on prom I was wearing a red dress so I was like my phone would look so slick with this so I had to use no case but anyways let's just hop right into it if you have an iPhone 5 this may be helpful if you don't if you have the iPhone 7 plus this will be helpful I'm pretty sure the 6 plus can fit in the 7 plus cases and vice versa most of these cases are from AliExpress if they aren't then I will let you know but if I don't recall where they're from, I'm sorry. Let's hop right into it. Here is my Jordan uh, shoe box with all my cases. I was just cleaning out my closet and then I found this and I was like, whoa, why don't I make a video on this? Like, So let's just go ahead and get started. I'm gonna try to mix it up with the iPhone 5 cases and the iPhone 7 cases so you don't have to leave at like the half point of this video if you don't have that certain phone. So first I'm gonna start with this case which I'm pretty sure is from AliExpress. So it is just a super cute texturized, I think this was like every case that I ever buy is like three dollars or under usually two dollars or under and it is a shimmery gold super super cute pattern and the feeling of it is just so nice i love the color my favorite color is blue but this is like a mint blue and can i just say i miss putting this on my phone it feels like it's handmade or something but the side is like a weird material too like they try to line it up but yeah i totally miss it knowing that my camera was small enough to fit in here is crazy because the iphone 7 plus has a huge camera the next one is this wallet case which i'm hoping to get another wallet case for my phone it is kind of annoying to have a wallet case when you're a constant user of your phone because you have to keep flipping it and closing it but this one is also from aliexpress i am literally a platinum member on aliexpress so this is why uh, i'm crazy that's why this is like has like a weird like fake suede feeling the inside is a hard plastic case and then it has two pockets for your cards and then on the side there's a pocket for the rest this is perfect if you just need to keep your like driver's license and then your debit card or something like that and then a couple dollars in here but i do have apple pay so i don't know what i would really use the wallet case for other than my driver's license but that is the second case. So let's move on to an iPhone 7 Plus case, which is one you've probably seen before. I have taken many Snapchats with this case on, and I feel like I just love those 90 vibes, like aesthetically pleasing cases. Some of these cases you also may have seen before if you have watched any other of my case videos, but this one was from AliExpress. It did get dirty on the side quite easily, as you can tell, it's not white anymore. But this is so cute. The print on it is awesome, definitely great quality. Sometimes I buy cases and the quality is not great at all. But yeah, it's just these geometric shapes with a grid. I love grids, so that is the third case. Let's do another iPhone 7 Plus case, and it is this super cute Saturn um, case. I don't, like I, like I forgot what it was, and this whole video is about cases. Anyways, it has this super soft texture. It is like a little flimsy. It's one that the side would probably break on. Like I have so many cases and the side just snap or drain off. But yeah, it's a super cute, like once again, aesthetically pleasing Tumblr-y themed effect on this case and I absolutely love it. I'm pretty sure this was like a dollar something so you can never ever ever go wrong with that. If you guys do wanna see an AliExpress iPhone case unboxing video or something else on AliExpress, please comment down below because I need your input. Okay, these used to be really in. This is for the iPhone 5. Um, it did break right here as you can see, but it is this really cheap. Like, I don't know how I thought my phone was protected in this. It's called like, oh, 
net case or a web case or something like that. I remember these used to be so popular. So yeah, I think this one actually may be from Amazon. I don't really remember. Um, that's how old it is. But yeah, it did crack really easily. You could see the side getting ready to freaking crack too. I'm sure you can still find these online, so it's not like I'm just showing you guys these for no reason. But yeah, if you really think this is cute and something you'd want on your phone, just look it up. Look up like a web case or like a net case. I forget what it's called. I think it was called like a bird's nest case. This next one is from Winners. This was actually the first case that I bought for my iPhone 5 because um, it was like $9, but it is from Roots and I totally destroyed it as you can see the bottom. The only reason I like this is because it was super protective and I just got my iPhone so obviously I'm gonna treat it like a baby. It has like the two layer casing so it has like the silicone-y one and then the plastic that goes on top. It was really cute. I still love this case and I wish I could find another cute protective case like this for my iPhone 7 Plus. But other than that, yeah, it broke at the bottom. It lasted me a while. The next one is one of my favorite cases, but I don't wear it because this thing tends to get dirty. I wore it for one day and it literally got so dirty. I had to wash it with soap and water. It does get clean though. You can find these for like a dollar or two. I got this off AliExpress. It was in my uh, case video a while ago, but yeah, it's little nose fell off. It's nose used to be pink, but yeah, it's just a little squishy. I love it so much. Just so cute to just squish. Um, keeping it in your pocket or sliding it in and out is gonna really make it dirty. But this is the iPhone 7 Plus case. I know you can get these for literally every iPhone model. So if you are in love with this, go ahead and pick one up from Amazon or AliExpress. The next case is for the iPhone 5. I got this one for my birthday, but I'm pretty sure it was from Amazon. Once again, another wallet case. This one is much better quality, once again, a hard casing. And then inside, it's from Holila, designed by Holila, whatever. I'm pretty sure they got it from Amazon, but yeah, it's just super cute, sparkly pink, kind of looks webbed pattern on it. But yeah, another wallet case, as you can tell, my iPhone 5 was all about the wallet cases. Here's a case that I really, really loved for my iPhone 5. It is from Winners or Marshalls. This little thing is like, I don't know. It's not like in the case, it's like a tag, like rubbery tag. The case feeling is so nice, but as you can see, right here it's shiny, there's some parts are shiny because that uh, soft coating did peel off. I miss this case so much, it was perfect for summer. One of my favorites, but it's by Native Union, just in case you want to go to their site and order hashtag not sponsored and never will be. I bought this Adidas case. It is a fake Adidas case. I got it from AliExpress once again. It has that super soft feel and it literally looks real, which I love. I got so many comments on these. I had a white one and a black one. So yes, I love this so much. I wish I could still use it on my phone. This is my vape case for my iPhone 7 Plus. It did break recently actually right on the side right here as you can see and yeah not very like good printed quality i did get questions about this case though i'm pretty sure it is from aliexpress as well here's my iphone 5 spec case that folded up to put it on which made it really really easy to just slide your phone in i wish i had a spec case for my iphone 7 i love spec i feel like it's just the greatest quality and it will protect your phone so so much here's a case that i bought but never worn and it looks like a usb popping out of an ice cream cone this is from aliexpress it was super cheap which is why i bought it i have still never worn it on my phone and i don't know if i ever will maybe in the summer but yeah it has that really soft texture to it as well here's my case because cats this is an inside joke me and my boyfriend we used to say because cats or because cats literally when we first met and then i found this i was like i need this and then we got matching cases so it was really really cute and awesome so here is a double layered case I'm pretty sure this was like five dollars off Aliexpress so it made your phone look like a different color and it did a pretty good job of it because I'm pretty sure some people did ask me how I got my phone like that but it's just a little plastic sheet and then a metal rim that goes around it what's this called the bumper then you put the back on oh that was the wrong way the back yeah I had a pink one a blue one and a gold one and people actually thought it was real so that was pretty cool the next one is from my iPhone 7 it's just this geometric one this was also in my uh, iPhone case unboxing and I think I've worn this like once for a little bit I'm sure the sides will get dirty as time comes around but this one is 
silicone and it's actually really good quality so it's a 10 out of 10 from me next is my fake Kylie case I also don't know why I bought this because I've never worn it and I don't know if I ever will Kylie is not even someone like I really look up to I just thought it was pretty cool that I could buy a knockoff that looked relatively alike except for this you can kind of tell it's a knockoff super cute marble case from Aliexpress with that super soft feeling once again the quality on this one is pretty good I love it and I'm pretty sure I will definitely wear this one again. This one I also got a lot of questions and compliments of. It's two faces intertwined. I don't know if you can see that, but it is a gold little line. So it was line line, whatever. I think it's like one of those drawings where the pencil like never picked up off the floor, but yeah, it is so cute and once again, that tumblery feel to it. This case is from Boathouse. I'm pretty sure I bought it because it was a dollar, hence why literally the paint is peeling off of it. And this was for my iPhone 5. It's this cute little tribal effect. As you can tell, I love all things tribal-y, not tribal. What, what would you call this? Mandela-y, I guess. And that is the other case. This is like one of the few cases that I ever bought in the store. There is the white Adidas case, my Jordan 23 case, and as you can tell, this one is peeling as well. This is also from AliExpress. Wow, that is horrible. Now we have one uh, case for each phone left, so I'm just gonna go and do my iPhone 5. This one is from Claire's because they were having like buy three, get three free or something like that. And my sister said, okay, pick something. And I picked this super adorable holographic snakeskin kind of pattern case for my phone. It did crack in the corner like as soon as I bought it, like really close because I dropped it on the floor. But other than that, totally love this case. It's breaking everywhere, but 10 out of 10 would buy again for my iPhone 7 Plus. And last but not least, my anti-social social club. Once again, this is a knockoff, so don't think it's real at all. I got it from AliExpress for like $2. Has that soft feel again. The camera hole and the flash hole are separated. Like, not all my cases are like that, but yeah, that is the last case. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe down below if you aren't already because I'm on that YouTube grind. And if you haven't seen my latest video make sure you go and do that just click on my channel name down below go click on a video you think you'd enjoy and that's gonna be it guys subscribe i'm probably gonna do another case haul and i'm out